All right, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kind of show you how to do this problem, you know, kind of the quicker, easy way, and then as well as a little bit way that may, might make a little bit more sense for you. Um, first of all, if we just go through our rules of logarithms, we have log, you know, base 5 of 5. Well, that's going to equal 1. And then we said log base 5 of 5 raised to the x. Well, that equals x. Now, why is that exactly the case? Let's pretend I wanted to evaluate this, trig uh, this logarithm. And so I set it equal to x. And I say, all right, let's go ahead and rewrite this, where I'd say 5 raised to what power equals 5 to the seventh power. Well, obviously, you guys can see by looking at this, if I rewrite this in exponential form, by using my one-to-one -one property of exponential equation, you can see that if I have the same base, well, therefore, my exponents are now going to be equal to each other. So therefore, I know that x is equal to 7. That's why this rule works for logarithms. So therefore, without having to show all this work, you can say log base 5 of 5 raised to the 7th is just going to equal 7. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you evaluate your logarithm. Thanks.